الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد اللهم عني على ذكرك وشكرك وحسن عبادتك آمين يا رب العالمين أيها الأحباب from the wonders of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's creation are many signs and many natural beauties that occur by the permission of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And this is the aqidah and the creed of the mu'min. As we see, ayyul ahbab, the beauty of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's creation. Here is a cave, a cave-like structure and water, ayyul ahbab, is coming out of this structure and I just made wudu out of this water. And this is a ni'mah, as you can see all around here is dry. But however, water is seeping out of this crack in the rock, subhanahu wa ta'ala, he created all of this. And we wonder at the beauty of creation and his signs, his ayat, but we reflect on these ayat so that we will remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, fi kitabi al-kareem, wa min ayatihi ya layla wa nahara wa shamsu wa al-qamr, la tasjidu li shamsi wa la lil-qamri wa shjidu lillahi ala di khalakuhunna in kuntum iyahu ta'budun. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, fi kitabi al-kareem, and from his signs is the day and the night, and the sun and the moon. Do not prostrate before the sun, nor the moon, but prostrate to Allah, the, the one who created you. And if it is him, you truly worship. So if you truly worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, although you see the beauty of his creation, that you will reflect, and this will help you have taqwa Allah Azza wa Jal. This, the wonders of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's beautiful creation will help you reflect and remember and hopefully in, encourage you in your spiritual growth. This is one of the reasons why I love to come out and see the signs of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, to see the beauty of His creation and reflect. Gives you some time to be alone, some time to to think and ponder the ayat that you read and to know and see the beauty of his creation and that he subhanahu wa ta'ala created all of this and he didn't create this in mere play and just and just but in fact Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created this as so that we would reflect so that we would be of the muhtahun those who remember Allah much pray to Allah much supplicate to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala much and reflect and make dhikr to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and we ask that Allah the Almighty blesses us to be of those who are to help us blesses us and is help and helps us and aids us to remember him and to be thankful to him and to have do righteous acts of worship for his sake, Subhana. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.